Hello everyone, so in this video we are going to learn how to add new WooCommerce product reviews to Microsoft Excel rows. So like whenever a product review is given by a customer in your website which is WooCommerce over here, so you want to record all those comments or reviews by the customers in a sheet and here we are taking MS Excel. So for this purpose rather than copying one review and then pasting in MS Excel you can create a complete automation where you will be able to integrate both of these applications and we can do this with the help of Fably Connect where our trigger will be new product review of WooCommerce and our action will be to add new row in MS Excel. Let us learn how to do that. So let us learn that how you can keep a record of all the reviews on any specific product that you receive on your WooCommerce. Like these are all my products on WooCommerce and whenever a customer leaves a review on any of the product on this website then they will be automatically collected over here. The name of the product will be here, rating, how many stars the customer has given and the review. If you want to add more fields, you can add according to your requirement. I am making a basic sheet for recording the reviews, for recording the reviews from the customers for any specific product. So let us begin. Sign in into our account so that I will reach this place where I can see all the applications provided by Pabli. And we are going to use Pabli Connect to create this automation. So click on access now. And that will take me to the dashboard of Pabli Connect. Reaching here, you will be able to see a big blue button on your right side where it is written create workflow. Click on the button and give a suitable name to your workflow. I'm going to name it as add new WooCommerce product reviews to MS Excel sheet. Click on create and then a blank workflow will be created for you like you can see on your screen. You will be able to see trigger and action, the two major modules of Pabli Connect on which the complete automation runs. Make sure that before that open your WooCommerce and your MS Excel sheet where you are going to record all the reviews and WooCommerce so that you can keep a check of the reviews that you are getting and also to connect both these applications to Pabli Connect. Now let us understand trigger and action. Trigger says when this happens and action says do this which means that trigger is going to be the first application, the place where the first event will take place. Like over here we have WooCommerce, WooCommerce is the trigger application where the event will be for review. Whenever a new review arrives, see new product review is the action. So it triggers when a new review for a specific product occurs. Any new review will be a trigger to this specific workflow. And as soon as it happens, then the action application, which is Excel over here, where we have already prepared a sheet with column names and all. Here the product name, rating and the review will be appeared. All right. So let us begin with the workflow over here. Trigger event we have already chosen new product review click on connect and connect your WooCommerce to Pabli Connect so that as soon as any product over here gets a review then that review should be brought over here as a response and then that data will be further used to add it over here so add new connection and now it is asking for consumer key consumer secret and website URL like you can see website URL is a very easy thing to do it's just till dot com so this is my WooCommerce and here this is my website I will copy it till here and paste it in my respective place remove the slash and this is my website now I want consumer key and secret key so let us follow these instructions given over here as the help text go to your WooCommerce settings here in settings you will find a tab called advanced click on advanced and then click on rest API here you have to add a key for which trigger or action this application is being used so click on add key and give details for your new key that is going to be created what is the description I am giving the description as reviews recorded and the permission is for read and write okay generate API key and now a consumer key and secret will be generated so copy it from here and paste it this is not something very common it is generated every time in a new way like a new key is generated every time for a new workflow so paste it at the respective places and click on save and your connection of WooCommerce to Pabli Connect will be done. So now you have the product ID over here and from this menu you have to choose that product for which you are going to create a review. So let us say that I am taking a wall watch. So there is a wall watch over here in my products. Let us go to all the products. And where is the wall watch? It is right here. Okay. Click on view 
so it will be appearing in front of you in the view format and here i will give review see zero reviews so i will be giving a review over here so i have chosen the product id and the status is approved that hold spam trash no only the approved ones will be coming over here okay you can also set it to all so that all kinds of product reviews will be sent here as a response right now i'm choosing approved and clicking on save and send test request go back to wall watch and give a review over here four ratings see this is my comment this is my review and i've given it four stars click on submit and then let's go here and here we have a response see verified the status is approved and then we have the review called great quality efficient working okay this is the product id and this is the product name so we also have a product id we can make a column over here for product id as well so i'm creating that that is what i said in the very beginning that it completely depends on how you want to create a record of the data that you are creating the workflow for so we have the product id product name the number of stars and also the review now one thing that is over here is that the review is appearing in this html format with this pn slash p so let us remove this close this module over here and click on this plus button to add one step between the trigger and action which is going to be text formatter text formatter is a feature built inside pably and as the name suggests we can format the text over here now we are going to choose the option of text parser because we are going to extract the text from between something okay connect text formatter with pably connect and first you have to map that text that you want to format so what we want was the review see you can straight away find the review rather than going and scrolling through the whole list of responses now this is the one we have mapped it so you know what is that every time a new response will appear over here it will be arriving in this html format only what you need to do is map that value over here so whatever is here like review it will be brought over here to text formatter we will apply the changes by removing this p and slash p and then the newly generated response will be sent to microsoft excel so what do we want after this p and before this slash p so let us put that over here after this p and before this okay so basically parsing is that we are extracting between these click on save and send test request and you will be shocked to see the response see we have the simple and direct review over here great quality efficient working so now close this module and proceed towards microsoft excel because now we are going to put the values at their final destination so choose the event as add row to worksheet okay adds a new row to the end of a worksheet so here we have no rows which means it will st start from the very beginning only click on connect and connect your excel to pably connect so that all the data that you have in this workflow can be easily transferred to excel and created a record over here so add new connection and connect with microsoft excel it will detect your presence account and you will just have to click on consent and accept now that the connection is done you will be having empty fields where you will be filling the data from the trigger application and also the text formatter responses now that we have it over here we have to first choose the workbook and worksheet name so the name of our workbook is woocommerce reviews and the sheet is sheet 1 so it is already chosen like that if you want you can open the drop down menu and select the one you are working upon all right now since it is already chosen we don't have to do anything column a is product name b is rating c is review and d is product id it is exactly what we made it over here so let us map the correct value what is the product name it is a wall watch so we will take it from the woocommerce responses and the review will be taken from the text formatter response so rather than scrolling through the long list you can simply type in the search and map data over here see wall watch is the name then what is the rating so the rating was 4 so you are not going to write 4 you are going to map that place where it is written 4 so every time the rating of the product arrives in the trigger application response then that rating will be sent over here for a brand new situation or brand new review okay what is the review we will take the review from text formatter and the product id so again i will type id over here and this is the product id so we have mapped all the values click on save and send test request and you will see that you will be receiving that data over here and see here we have the name is here the rating is here and the review is here you can just drag this one and 
bring this to smaller one yeah and the product id is also here so we have all the data which means that every time a new product will be made and we have the response which says that this range of these cells of your sheet has been updated okay which means that this workflow works perfectly fine so this is how we can create this automation that whenever a new product review is given then it will be formatted by this text formatter it will be parsed and then added to the worksheet like this so this was the whole video i hope this helped not just these applications but you can integrate many other applications using pably connect if you have any issue regarding pably you can email us at support@pably.com you can ask your queries at forum.pably.com and if you have any doubts regarding our pricing then you can connect us through this given website if you found this video helpful in any way then make sure to share this with your friends and colleagues to make their life easier by creating automations we will meet in the next video till then do not forget to like our video and subscribe to our channel thank you